Ever find yourself staring at random everyday objects and thinking to yourself, oh, that's very interesting. Every little thing around us has some qualities that are interesting in one way or another. If you really think about it, uh, they are like a book that's waiting to tell you a story. We just need to be a little more observant and pay a little attention to them to actually decipher the story. In this class, I'll be teaching you how to find those interesting qualities and express them on your canvases. Hi there, I'm Ayan. I'm an artist from India. I've been working in the entertainment industry for over eight years now. I mostly work with uh, games and animation. I also like to wander around strange places. This class will broadly be about finding interesting qualities in seemingly everyday ordinary objects. I'll teach you how to interpret them in your own way. I'll also cover a lot of the basic principle that goes into planning a composition for your outdoor paintings. Throughout this class, you'll learn how to develop your observational skill, grow your visual library, find a composition that tells a story, simplifying complex objects or subjects into uh, something that is more presentable, and overall executing a outdoor painting. You'll then put these skills to use to paint your own plein air that will be emotionally charged and outstanding. By painting plein airs on a regular basis, you'll be able to build up your visual library. A visual library is nothing but a collection of memory and information that we store inside us. And uh, when we are painting from imagination, we can recall those and we can paint them without using any reference or looking at them. As your visual library expands, you will have a lot of different options to pull from when you are actually painting from imagination. And the results would be much more unique because you are not directly taking references. Instead, you are just uh, pulling from your memories. With the mobility of iPad, we can just pick it up and go outside. Just like that. Isn't that exciting? It's a good excuse to just get out of the chair and explore. With all that said, I hope you are as excited as me to get started. Let's jump right in.